Grace Kitchens presents Creative Cooking. In this series, we showcase the talents of some of our favorite chefs as they demonstrate how to prepare some of their favorite dishes. And now, here is today's host. Hello, welcome to Creative Cooking. Whether it is between two slices of hard dough bread or steamed or boiled with rice, mackerel is one of Jamaica's favorite economical sources of protein. Our guest today is Chef Walken Austin, Executive Chef at Grace Kennedy Limited. Welcome, Chef Austin. Thank you. We are delighted to have you. My pleasure to be here. I tell you a little secret about Chef Austin. Oh, no. He started his career fresh out of high school at Grace Kitchens. Every opportunity he got, he was in the kitchen, he was always volunteering his services. <laughs> and, you know, I remember we were just excited by this young man. Dr. Heather Little White recommended that this young man go to Runaway Bay Heart Academy. So he was in the first batch or second batch of students at that institution. Very first batch, residential first, intake. First batch of residential students. He did so well at Runaway Bay Heart that as part of um, his prize, he got a scholarship to George Brown College. The rest is history. Later on, he studied at the University of Technology. And today, about 20 years after, he has joined the company as our executive chef. We are delighted to have you. It's a pleasure, ma'am. I'm proud of you. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> what are you cooking for us today? We'll be doing a Grace Jack mackerel salad for you. Here we have our mayonnaise in our bowl. We're going to add to that some lemon juice. Sugar. And some black pepper. I'm going to whisk this together. I'm going to whisk it until this sugar has dissolved a little. Then we're going to add our celery that we have cut from the stalk crosswise. Some onion. Some diced oat eaty apple. Of course, we're going to have our jack mackerel, which we pat dry from the tomato sauce. Just gonna break it up inside of this lovely mixture here. It'll mix together. Now to make the mixture look a bit more hearty, you can add some elbow macaroni. Of course, this is optional. This side goes very quickly, all right? Here you'll be having your plate, your lettuce leaves, you're going to lay it down. You're going to arrange it in the plate. And of course, you're going to break up in bite-sized pieces some of your lettuce leaf. Without twisting them because you sort of ruin the leaves that way when you twist them. Just break them easily apart. When you twist the lettuce leaves, that is when they become discolored. Just so you know. So just tear them very gently apart like that. From here now, you are going to just spoon out your mixture on top of your lettuce leaf. This mixture can serve four persons quite easily. For a luncheon, 
a little party, a little get together that you might want to have. All right? You're gonna garnish it with some Otaheite apple, some sweet pepper, and a sprig of parsley in the center. Hi, Chef Austin. That is mouth watering. I know that. Uh, I mean, I'm seeing it, and it's a salad that I have had. She made it for me before. Really, is very good. You have used the Grace Jack mackerel in an excellent way. You have combined that with Grace Elbow macaroni. But if you didn't have Elbow macaroni, chef, what else could we have used? You, you could have easily used some Yum. spaghetti and break it up you if you want. You could have also used spaghetti. You can spaghetti. use mm -hmm. Irish potato. Irish potato. We have a lot of that around oh, now. Yeah, from Christiana and yes. Kelly's area, yeah, man. And the people in Trelawney, and I don't want to leave out the people in Hanover, you know, they have excellent yellow yam. Yam could have been used. And how about the people in St. Mary? You have green banana, use that in place of the pasta. Even sweet potato. Thank you for sharing this very creative meal idea. And listen, I just want to see you soar further because I know one day you're going to become a master chef. <laughs> I thank you, chef. My pleasure, Maisie. Okay. We demonstrated how easy it is to create a hearty and healthy salad that your family is sure to enjoy. In From the Mailbox, we look at other types of salads that are easy to make and taste delicious. Joining me for this segment of the program is Chef Austin. Chef, here we have displayed the hearty salad that you made. And we have three other salads that we have displayed. Let us look at them. You want us to start over here? We have a stuffed tuna, tuna stuffed with um, inside of tomatoes. We call these plummy tomatoes. Plummy tomatoes. Okay. But you know, chef, I, and these are cut across, and the piece that you cut across is used to create a sale. Eh? <laughs> this is a side salad made up of cucumber, cabbage shredded, carrot shredded, of course. And different shapes and forms are oh, used yes. in this salad, and also different colors. The, you know, the orange from carrots, the green from lettuce the green and white from cucumber slices. And look how the cucumber slices are cut, actually, yeah. horizontally, right? How about that, a fruit salad, eh? <laughs> mm. Perfect for dessert, yes. There's a fruit cocktail. Fruit cocktail, yes. Right. Mm -hmm. Different What's... different mixture of fruits, different colors. Right. Uh, with its own juices. Right. You know, you immerse that in there, let it marinate. Very lovely after you chill it in the refrigerator for about 15 to 20 minutes. Chef, thanks for being with me on the program. It's it my is pleasure, pleasure. ma'am. That's our show for today. Remember that this and other recipes are available to you from Grace Kitchens. We invite you to just phone us or write us or email us at Grace Kitchens and we'll be happy to send them to you. Till next time, thanks for watching. This is Chef Season on Creative Cooking. And we hope you enjoyed today's show. Join us every Monday morning at 7.35 as we showcase the talents of some of our favorite chefs, demonstrating some of their favorite dishes here on Smile Jamaica, It's Morning Time. Chef Season continues next Monday morning on Creative Cooking, 7.35 on TVJ, and with a repeat at 2.50 p.m. every Sunday afternoon. Don't miss it.